Hi guys and welcome to another video. This time we'll be looking at gems and dust. Uh, what are gems? These bottom row here are gems. They're used to enhance and add stats to weapons and armor, providing they have the gem slots. This piece of armor will accept dodge, health and crit gems. Adding gems will give stats to this piece of armor in either dodge, health or crit. Where to get gems? You can get gems from events, which is a good place, but they only come across every now and then. Gem Bay, which is obviously the best place to get them. All you have to do is go on a journey, destroy as many squads as you can, and claim as many points as you can. Then go into the store and buy purple gem, blue gem or green gem. I wouldn't bother with the green gems, I'd only bother with blue if you're lowish level and then the purple ones. When you do buy one of these, it's going to be completely random what it's going to be for, but it will be of purple, blue or green rarity. I wouldn't bother buying these chests. So just earn your points and buy these, the blue gem or purple gem. Another place you can get them is again every so often there'll be a traveling merchant turn up and towards the bottom he'll have uh, gems for sale as you can see here the orange legendary ones are gonna cost you 7,000 diamonds you can get purple ones for mana and wood which is good or a random blue or a random purple for diamonds you can also buy dust here to upgrade them in the marketplace, under the treasures tab, there's a chest of gems you can buy. You can get a rare for 199 diamonds, an epic for 999 diamonds, or a legendary for nearly 2,000 diamonds. The you might get chance is very low, and I wouldn't advise buying these chests. When you get a gem, it's going to be a level 1. So for this purple damage gem, you can fill it up with dust, 20,000 experience points, and it will take the damage from 228 to 332. And that's just for the purple gem. The lower the rarity or the higher the rarity, and the numbers will go up accordingly. For instance, a green damage gem will be doing just 24 damage. When you level it up, it will be doing 48. To level a gem up, you'll need dust. To get dust, you need to break down shards, the same shards you use for crafting. To get a shard, you break down an item like weapons, armor, ring, or an amulet. And then to turn that into dust, you need to go here to the gem workshop, tap on recycling, and in this window here, tapping on your shards will put it across to the right hand side and it will cost you gold to turn into dust. We can see that one grey shard will get you 15 dust and cost 100 gold. A green shard will get you 25 dust and cost you 10,000 gold. A blue shard will get you 30 dust and cost you 40,000 gold. A purple shard will get you 45 dust and cost you 150,000 gold. Dust from the different shards is all the same. However, the higher level of rarity will give you more XP when leveling up a gem. One grey dust will give you 1 XP and cost you 10 gold. Whereas a blue dust will give you 70 XP and cost you 700 gold. A purple dust will give you... 550 XP and cost you 5,500. An orange dust will give you 1,200 XP and cost you 42,000 gold. If you have enough, you can completely level up a gem with any of the rarities of dust. Okay, so how do we level up a gem? Tap on the dweller that you want to add a gem to their equipment. My dwellers are too low, but in my storage here, I've got a 
piece of mage equipment that has gems then tap on the gem slot tap on inlay this brings you the window where your equipment is this can be a weapon armor ring or amulet or it could be a, a weapon or armor soul later on in the game then depending on which gem you want to insert just tap it to open up the window if you've got gems for all of these then just hit this green box here and it will fit the best ones you've got in it's worth noting as well that the different rarities of gems will cost more gold to insert so a grey gem will cost 15,000 gold a green gem will cost 50,000 gold a blue gem will cost a hundred thousand gold and a purple gem will cost two hundred and fifty thousand gold if you wanted to level up a gem just tap on upgrade on the left hand side select the type of gem you want to upgrade we'll do this damage one and then you can either tap the green button here and it will fill it up with all the necessary dust or if you want take those out you can put in whatever dust you want or can afford the cost of filling up the gems goes up depending on their rarity a grey gem will go up from level 1 to level 5 and will cost nearly 19,000 gold a green gem will cost 300,000 gold as you can see here and will go up to level 10 a blue gem will cost 1.5 million gold and go up to level 20 a purple gem will cost you 6 million gold and go up to level 30 an orange gem will cost you 24 million gold and go up to level 40 and a red gem, a red ancient gem will cost you 60 million gold and go also go up to level 40 but because the orange and red gem are both level 40 it doesn't mean that they give you the same power the red gem starts at a higher level and ends at a higher level even though there's only the same amount of levels in it let's finish upgrading this green gem okay 300,000 gold plus all the dust and it's leveled up this went from 24 damage to 48 so with double double dar damage for this one gem we can also merge gems by combining two maxed out gems of the same rarity color together will give us a gem of the same type of the next level up You need two gems of the same rarity, both max level. Also, you're going to need a scroll, otherwise you most likely will fail it. Now we need to add a scroll. To do this, click on the green box with the plus sign. Before we do that, you'll see the chance of a successful merging is 70%. So we need a scroll to add other 30% which happens to also be green so if you're merging two orange gems it will only give you a 30 percent chance and it will it will almost guaranteed to fail you will need a scroll of success of the same color rarity to succeed luckily i have a green one here select that and now success has gone from 70 percent to 100 percent so when you have your two gems that are both leveled up and of the same rarity and you have a scroll of success of the same rarity to get it to 100% and you also have enough gold to be able to merge then tap the merge button and it will combine two of these gems into the next level up. Merging successful and now we have one blue gem instead of the two green ones we had earlier. We can merge gems all the way up to orange, the legendary ones. When you merge two orange gems, that will get you a red ancient gem, and that's the highest level at the moment. Going back to recycling, another thing that will get you dust are the scrolls. 
Unlike the shards, they don't cost you any gold to turn into dust. I wouldn't um, use scrolls for dust. And one last thing, guys. The different relative gems have different prices of inserting. So a grey gem here will cost 15,000 gold. A green gem will cost 50,000 gold. A blue gem will cost 100,000 gold. A purple gem will cost 250,000 gold. And an orange gem will double that at 500,000 gold. Um, because the higher the rarity, the more they cost, it's a good idea to, when you're merging, to insert one of the gems first, say a blue one at 100,000 gold, and then when you merge it, it will automatically be upgraded to a purple, and it won't cost anything to insert it because it's already it's already in there. Okay guys, that's it for this video. Please hit the like button if you liked. Hit the subscribe button to see more. And leave a comment if you want me to do something else in another video. Or if you have any questions. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.